Shavers Creek was founded in 1976 as an environmental center for Penn State students and visitors to learn about the wildlife around them. The types of activities available there range from school outreach events and summer camps to research initiatives and conservation projects. There's a big trend right now in the field that if a bird is flighted, they shouldn't wear equipment. One of their biggest programs is the Animal Care Program, where they work with animals that are native to Pennsylvania. Joe Whitehead, the program coordinator, details his typical day on the job. Basically, I help coordinate the comings and goings in that within the reptile and amphibian program. And then I'm also the lead trainer on about four of our, our raptors and assist with a few others, so making sure that they're cared for as well. Inside their facility, there are even more animals that visitors can learn about. The facility has been open for just over a year after it spent the last two years undergoing renovations. They received $7.5 million from Penn State Outreach and other private philanthropy to provide an even better experience for students and visitors. The animals here at Shavers Creek range from reptiles to birds of prey, like the great horned owl behind me. As part of the animal care program here, Penn State students take part in a work study getting hands-on experience. So I did learn today about um, how to read their body language and if you know that something's a stress behavior or a comfort behavior, so that's not something that I would have known before. Like today I fed the turtles, I got to feed the frogs and the toads, which is always fun. It's definitely my favorite part, is when I get to interact with them, because you surprise them, like their personalities. Joe Whitehead hopes that the animal care program leaves a lasting impression on visitors and students. Our goal with having these animals here is that people come here and they have a connection with those animals and they're inspired to go do something to help those animals then. Reporting from Center County, I'm Michael Dare.